Okay, now I'm gonna take out these cooks. I like to distract them. I like to grab this bottle here. Um, select uh, R2 to get ready to throw it, and then L, I mean, no, R1. It's R2 and R1. R1 actually throws it. I wanna throw it into the cooler. he would walk around the table like that, but come on, go inside more. Yeah, go inside. Now, just to let you know, I've noticed, I now notice, after playing this game, through the training in the first level, the police station. Um, you remember the Xbox and the PS2, uh, the original versions, the uh, non-HD versions, they had a automatic save whenever you would actually get to a specific point in the level. Well, this game doesn't have that. What you have to do is you have to hit start, and you have to do either a quick save or a save game. A quick save is basically like a save state. Um, so I'm going to hit a quick save. Then if I die or I screw up, I can hit a quick load, and it will load me exactly right to this point. So I'm, I'm going to try not to edge, like move an inch, then quick save, move an inch, then quick save. If I do, for one part, I'll just edit it out, but I really don't want to do that. I can't kill anybody, right? I kill I can't remember if I Okay, he's gonna notice the lights are out. Let me do this. Oh, hold on, let me look at the where's the mission objectives? Oh no, it's probably on my offset and I can't Usually the mission objectives okay. Deactivate the laser grid. Usually says don't kill anybody. That's all it says. So I guess I can shoot him? I don't think I can. Hey, I'm in here. All right, so he gets. Yeah, this is where the game doesn't make any sense. Like, if a guard doesn't fire a bullet, if I just distract the first guard and I'm hitting them, like other guards will be like, they'll know that I'm there and I have no idea why. The song will still play, but thank God the song went away. Meaning that no one knows I'm here. After knocking that guy out, but. I don't think there's anything really There's an asshole right here. Hopefully I can just, let me try to take him out first. There we go. Come with me into the darkness. Now this quick save is pretty cool in a way. I just don't want to abuse them. Okay, so there's a guy all the way over there, but what I want to do is, I think there's a guy actually behind that guy. So 
So I want to go over here. Yep. Good old splinter cell. I would like to try to play the whole series. I've only played, like I said, the original game, which is this, and Pandora Tomorrow. I never even played Chaos Theory. Like I said, I have it on this disc. It comes with all three originals, so. I thought those were like curtains that you could just walk through. staring at a wall, but okay. <laughs> and most of the guards look like Nikolaus himself. It's funny. There's something at this computer which I'll never read, of course. No, maybe not. Yeah. Got an incoming colonel, Fisher. Make the most of him. You'll need him conscious and cooperative if you want to unlock the retinal scanner sealing the door to the courtyard. That's detailed intelligence. Knowing everything is my job. You know what? Okay, yeah, I remember this. The colonel comes down. Oh, I think he saw the lights being shut off or something from the uh, kitchen. I heard him flick a switch. Where's he at? Come on, asshole. There he is. I'll do a quick save. Take him over to this retinal scanner. We learn this in training. Access granted, and by the way, you have cataracts. Satchel. A med kit, nice. Uh, I do remember, this is, uh, this is where you would get an automatic save in the original version. So I guess I'll do a quick save, why not? All right, how do I? It was ready to see me. I heard it zoo, uh, like lock on to me. That was close.
All right, this is where I have to use the laser mic to hear their conversa uh, conversation on that elevator. The glass elevator's in motion. Make with the laser mic, Fisher. It's mission critical that we hear what Grinko and Mass say before they reach the top. Uh, uh. Navigate. Why don't you rip it out with pliers? <laughs> we had some difficulty with blocking ship. You can see fibers of muscle tissue still attached. Nasty. Nasty. You're in the wrong line of work to avoid getting gore on your hands. Whatever Nicolab does in Azerbaijan is his own conscience is burdened. You are just a tool? You're a tool. I'm the technology. I'm the cleanup man. All the blood's on yours and Nicolaj's hands. I'm clean. And it is? It's what? Clean. Azerbaijan? Yeah, man. The operation's goddamn immaculate. Except for the files, Nicolaj insists on keeping on his own machine. You need to talk to that. Sounds like we found the subdermal. I get no... Quick save. Nervous when the bad guys start making blood jokes. That conversation's going straight to the Joint Chiefs, and we're gonna need more. Nicolaj's computer. You guessed it. Get inside his office and access that machine. Alarms aren't mission critical anymore. We're moving into Fifth Freedom territory. Nice. Fifth Freedom means you can start killing motherfuckers. <laughs> Oh my god. Look at that. Bad aiming. He didn't see me? There he did, okay. It didn't take me long to use my fifth freedom. Stick that I can uh, never read. I guess I take it since this is a new area of the level, I would get an automatic save here, so you know what I'm going to be doing. Oh, it's all right. Okay, it's auto saving. Never mind. Can I use the optic cable? Is 
This is one of the few times I actually use this. Close the door. And hopefully they won't come back up. Okay, I know there's a Somebody's coming. in the original game but this is ridiculous I have the crosshairs right on I know the pistol isn't the mo most uh, accurate thing but good lord at least my whole clip just trying to take out one thing it's horrible for headshots you have to be like right next to the guy Without him knowing to get a successful headshot. I love this controller, but I'm noticing I'm having problems like uh, quickly uh, lock picking a door. And you think they would have fixed this? I know I'm going on a rampage here, a rant, but you know this whole. You have to put a body down to open the door. Like, you think, I can, I can understand in the first game, okay, they didn't implement that. But you think, like, on a remake, they would at least, like, fix the little things like that? Like, the annoying things? I don't know. Come on, Ubisoft. I love you, but... Clock. I never, I never heard these sounds before. But then again, I played this game on like normal composite cables. Come on, jump up there. Come on. It's funny because usually I'm up in this ventilation system whenever that guy is like, that guy that I just shot types in that key code. Continue with the um, 
name of this place? The Georgian Defense Ministry. Yeah, that's it. Uh, next time. Probably finish it up. See you later.